How's it going, everyone? I'm PhilTheGamer555, and welcome back to more Octopath Traveler. In the previous episode, we entered the Cave of Ryo. Yeah, Cave of Ryo. That's what I'm going with. And it was good. We defeated the Blotted Viper. We've helped, or given the antidote to, or the Venom, I guess, to Zeph, and hopefully that will make Nina better. So with that being done, we're going to go and catch a few winks at Elephant's place. Take a short rest? Yeah, I guess so. Later that night. Hmm. I wonder how Zeph is doing. I shouldn't worry. He'll be fine, like always. You know, I... You know, Zeph. I've given it all the, to be the best apothecary I can be. To be more like you-know-who. But sometimes I feel like I'm still so far away. Yeah, that's right. All it takes is a stiff breeze to blow this backwater village right off the map. And yet, this is where I was born and raised, where I learned my craft. It's got grouchy... Gerdas, who I ain't never seen smiling. Meryl's got her act together, but she still needs a shoulder to cry on now and then. Gotta keep an eye on old Alex cough, too. And you, Zeph, I've been giving you a hard time since the cuts know when. You invited me to study together with you under your father. Took care of the books after we went into business together. <laughs> right, what was I thinking? I better stick around here after all. Now then. But not here. I better go see how Zeph is holding up. Ow! The flame take me. It worked! Nina's feeling better by the hour. <laughs> I knew it. With you on the job, was there ever any doubt? Thank you, Alfin, for everything. You... you saved my sister's life. How can I ever repay you? Don't even mention it. I helped out someone in a bind. Simple as that. Those words... I remember, when we were still small and the Great Pestilence came. Father could cure every disease known to man, but for the first time, he was at a loss. Then one day, a traveler came to town bearing an elixir the likes of which we'd never seen. This'll do it. Thanks, mister. But why'd you save me? We ain't got no money, you know. Listen, son, and listen well. I saw someone in a bind, and I helped him out. Simple as that. Ever since that day, you've worked your damnedest to become just like your hero. To help people out, just like he did. Oh, um, is that how it went? Alfin? We've been together forever now. So I can tell. You want to leave this place, don't you? You want to travel the world and help as many people as you can. Just like him. 
<laughs> you knew. <laughs> I'm not daft, you know. But still, this is my home. I know you're a skilled apothecary, Seth. At least as good as... No, probably even a little better than me. But I can't leave you to look after the whole village on your own. Besides, who else would cut your ego down to size? Who'll listen to Gertis's grumblings and Meryl's tales of unrequited love? I will. I'll do it all. Don't you worry about anything. I'll see that the villagers are happy and healthy. I swear it on my life. So go out and see the realm, Alf. Do it with your heart at ease and your head held high. Guess what, Ma? I'm going on a journey. Time to see just how far my talents will go. I'm gonna save folks the world over, just like the man who saved me. Keep an eye on me, would ya? Elf! Thank the gods you're still here. Come on, Seth. I didn't ask for a going away party. <laughs> Just a little present for the road. It's nothing special, but... I want you to take my satchel. That way, no matter how far you travel, I'll be right there with you. Wow. You weren't kidding when you said it's nothing special. Uh, it was the only thing that came to me. Thanks, Seth. I'll take good care of it. Here, why don't you hold on to mine, too? Now there's a plan. I'll put it to good use, Alf. Alrighty then. See you around. Be safe out there, friend. And so Alfin set forth on his journey to travel far and wide and ease the pain of the sick and suffering, just as one man once did for him. Little, little did he know what awaited him in his travels. Alright, so we're done with that. Now it's time to get out of here. Let's go, squad! Oh yeah, I should also just point out, this is a very important thing that must be said. Both me and my sister, like, hardcore ship Alfin and Zeph. It's just something that has to be done. I mean, come on, they are literally sitting there trading ba or satchels with each other now. <laughs> but seriously though, I ship it. I love it so much, it's just the way they are. The way they act together. Oh wow, he's like way off in the distance. Gold shore. Okay, well we're heading toward... Uh... Therian, so Boulder Fall is next, so we gotta head upwards. Boulder Fall to the left, Clearbrook to the right. South Clearbrook Traverse to Sunshade. Oh, I've been down there already. Don't feel like going back down there again. Sunshade is a dangerous, dangerous place. A good day That's also a lot of frogs. I am ready. Naito, bring your shade. Ow, oh, frogs. Frogs and wasps. Two nightmares of much. Kidding, not really. I'm not a fan of wasps, but I'm not that concerned about 
uh, walk, or frogs in my life. Frogs are whatever, they're not scary, they're honestly pretty adorable. <laughs> Done, not bad. Alfin didn't even get a turn. Alright, Alfin leveled up, not bad. Give him to level 10. Oh man, who am I gonna replace next? That's gonna be a tricky one. Um, because I just got Alfin and I like Alfin. I wanna keep him, but I like Primrose as well, and I like Ulbrich. This is like the group I like the most so far. But I don't know Therian at all yet, so I might like him a lot anyway. So I think it's between Ulbrich and Primrose right now. I want to now take Ulbrich out next, though, because although Ulbrich is really good and handy to have, you surprised your foe. Okay. Oh, cool. I get to do all my attacks first. Not bad. Hey, look, it's that cat that I won't be able to hit. Actually, I did hit him. Wow, that's impressive. But no, as much as I like Ulbrich, I think I will replace him next. I will cut you down! Now. The is gonna run away. That's why I'm not really worried. Bring it off. It. it looks like I'm fighting a weird egg. See ya. I don't understand how to defeat that thing. Cool. Primrose leveled up. Boulder Fall kind of makes me think of a Death Mountain from Zelda. Gives me that kind of vibe. Also, that looks like a really fat hyena. Oh, it is a hyena! It just looks fatter than normal. I don't know what a hyena actually looks like. In terms of real life, I've never seen a hyena. But... I guess that was right. Naito, bring your shade. So what is this other thing called? A hatchling? I wonder if they open up eventually and they release themselves to the world. Hopefully not. I will cut you down. Nice, take out the hyenas. Now I just gotta take out these hatchlings and I'm done. Or not. Done. I am ready. Come on, game, just kill it. It's just an egg. Thank you. It's just an egg, you guys. Why are you getting wrecked? Herb of Awakening, okay. North Boulder, Boulder Fall Pass to Boulder Fall. Quarry Crest, Clear Brook. What's over here then? I don't know what this is. <laughs> I'm kind of just in an exploring or exploration. Why do my words keep like slowing down when I'm trying to speak? The last few episodes this has been like, Bleh. and then I just derp out and I have no words. It keeps happening. Ooh, nice! And seeing them all die too, even better. All right, axe works on them. Oh no! Oh, the spear works. No, it does not. But I killed him anyway, so I'll take it. One more round, and I'll get another level for Alfin. That'd be great. One soul stone, not bad. I'm gonna backtrack this way and go north instead, because I think that'll take me to Therian. That also is a really big... Vulture? Well, yeah, it would be a Vulture. No, a Condor. Yeah. Come on guys, I think find something weak, or weak against. Clearly none of the stuff I just used. Here goes nothing. 
I missed. I missed. Yeah. I am ready. Naito, bring your shade. Well, nothing really hurts his condor, does it? I mean, there's only two things, I guess. Maybe this will work. There we go. Should've been doing that originally. Okay, fine, you know. Break the condor before it can attack me and ruin my life. Wow, condors are really strong. Clearly, I don't want to run into this thing too much. It's taking a lot of hits to knock them out. I'll do my best. Ooh, over it just died on me. That's great. That's what I'm here for. Alright, I should be able to knock him out though. I would hope anyway. Oh, I should have just healed. I'm like banking on him, he's just gonna die and I shouldn't be. Oh my goodness, no, that did not just happen. I still broke him anyway, but I just like miss, miss, miss. That was just a tragedy to watch. Okay, never mess with condors. They'll beat you up. Can you please die? Ah, I'm using heal more. I'm in so much like pain right now at this condor. I can't risk it. There we go. Don't mess with condors. They will wreck you. No matter what. I mean nobody well actually, Obert died, so never mind. Don't mess with them. They are menace to the world. This place is really confusing. Oh, really? I just want to read the sign. You're, okay, I'm like, if you're a condor, I'm going to be upset. But it wasn't, so I guess I'm happy. Okay, that's effective against the creepy flying thing over there. Good. I wouldn't mind trying to knock out the hatchling. It's kind of annoying to deal with. The hyenas are really easy to kill, so at least that's a good thing. Like, I find that even when you're not breaking them, you're still hitting them really hard. Alright! <laughs> Try again! Can I read the sign? Boulder Falls to the right. Okay. Well, that's where I want to go. War kill and boulder falls to the right. All right, so I just want to go up here. I also want to fight this enemy apparently because he's coming. This will be an easy one though. I'm not too scared of this. You surprised your vote. Good job. You? I will cut you down. I'm Naito, bring your shade. I like how I'm just like spamming these attacks just to kill them quickly. See, look at those hyenas are really easy to defeat. The hatchlings are a little bit annoying. Not too annoying, but they're annoying. I am ready. Now to the work trying to knock the hatchling out first, and then Alfin can break the next one. 
and then I'll be good. All right. <laughs> I am ready. The show is over. Okay. Can I just get to Boulder Fall? Um, so I think we won't be getting to Therian in this episode. I'll get to him and that's gonna be as far as we go, but a lot longer than I expected it to be, to be honest. I am ready. Okay, so the Agrus weren't on him. Okay, perfect. Even spears work. Now I know things that work against that guy. I just gotta kill everything. Perfect. Just kill that guy. Use luminescence again. That should not get the hyenas. Oh, maybe not. I'm wrong. That's not a big deal. I will cut you down. Now they're dead. With each battle, I grow stronger. I'm getting so much sleep weed, I don't even know what to do with it. Oh, I thought I was running into another enemy. It's like, please no. Found more than enough on the way here. Hello to you. Welcome to Boulder Fall, the largest settlement here in the Clifflands. What is it, youngin? The cliffside stairs will take you down to the commoners district. It can get rough down there, so watch yourself. <laughs> here in Boulder Fall, the poor types live below, the wealthy up top. Us? Guess we're somewhere in the middle. Okay, it's an interesting look at town. Hello. The staircase to the east leads to Ravis Manor. The truth is, it's the most well-guarded place in town, and they turn almost everyone away at the gate. Okay, well, there's Therian. What is it, youngin? I already talked to you. Yeah, I did. Okay, well, you know what? That's gonna be it for the episode. We'll talk to Therian in the next one. We'll start his story. In the next episode, it should be awesome. I'm looking forward to doing it. I hope you're looking forward to seeing it as well. I definitely am because I'm hearing good things about him. I just don't know anything about him yet. So that's going to be it for the episode. Definitely subscribe for more Octopath Traveler and definitely show your support by sharing the video out with a friend. Other than that, thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Alright, see ya.